What's happening? Did we do it and we just skipped the cutscene on accident by dying? <laughs> so, we broke the game, Mark. I hate this damn level. Oh, you're not on my pelican with me, Mark. I feel so alone. I feel so Thank alone. God. <laughs> Shut your fucking hole. Oh, I can't shoot. I always hate this. Symphony. <laughs> Fine, Symphony. It's hard to say. Your mom's hard to say. What? What does that even mean? <laughs> Is my paycheck back there? Ah, oh, thank you, God weapon. <laughs> First shot is headshot. I was like, yes. And I know you're like, oh, thank dear God above. I'm never ever giving you up again. If I ever find you. There are like moments in this game where I would give up the pistol just because I got so tired of using it and then you go without it for a while in Legendary and you're like, never again. Don't ever leave me again, baby. <laughs> that sounded delicious. You're a liar. Get out of the way, you stoop. Ah, oh, thank God. At least die so <laughs> easily with this thing. Why is it in this one they don't have bunkers of weapons? I don't know, because they just couldn't, probably couldn't do it, dude. Back then, there wasn't a lot of code they could put onto this. Oh, uh, did you hear why um, the Legacy Collection of Metal Gear Solid, Hideo Kojima at... Uh, I don't um, think that's his name. Hideo Kojima, I'm sorry, I'm stuttering, announced last night that the Metal Gear Solid Legacy Collection will not be on the Xbox. Reason being, he could not put uh, Metal Gear Solid 4 on it. Reason why is if he put it on the Xbox, since the Xbox uses DVD format on their games and not Blu-ray discs, the game with Metal Gear Solid 4 has so much data in it, it would literally take seven discs just to run it on Xbox. It's that much of a difference, apparently. And he said maybe in the future, if Xbox gets, like, if the Xbox 720 has, like, better, you know hardware or discs or software drive or whatever, it can actually handle all the code that Metal Gear Solid 4 puts out, then maybe he'll release the Legacy Collection onto the Xbox, but for the time being, it's not coming out. And he said he would not include, give Xbox the Legacy Collection without Metal Gear Solid 4, because then it wouldn't be the Legacy Collection. It'd be everything but the one game everybody likes to play. And Master Chief and Solid Snake on the same console. They already are. You can buy the HD Collection still. Which has I just Metal think it's Solid, funny. Which has Metal Gear Solid you're 2 and 3. Boy. I know, well, Hideo, it's Hideo Kojima's poster boy. It's not Sony. Sony just has no rights right to Metal Gear Solid. Kind of Plus, actually, Solid Snake's first system was a Nintendo Game Boy. So he was Nintendo's poster boy first. And then well, they never became... really po put him up as a poster boy then. It's Mario, right? Yeah, Mario, Mario was like. The Mario day was dies, the. Uh... And Mario doesn't die. Yeah. Well, Mario was like the poster, but then back then they didn't think M-rated games would go anywhere. That's the reason why. They're like, no, because they thought video games were just for little kids, you know? They didn't really think there was a reason to make adult video games like Metal Gear. And even then, Metal Gear, I think it was like a T or E-rated game, because there was no real blood. I don't even... I'd have to look at the Game Boy games again, or the SNES games again. I think it was on SNES, too. I'm not even sure. I know, they, I know they moved it on to the Nintendo and Super Nintendo and, like, Game Boy and stuff. I know there's a bunch of them. I think... I can't remember, because I came into the series when Metal Gear Solid Twin Snakes came out, which was the remake of the first game for the GameCube. There's a shout-out from Hideo Kojima for saying thank you to Nintendo for giving him his start. And even though Sony has rights to Snake for now, it's still his character. Yeah, so his grave. <laughs> well, now Sony doesn't have rights to it anymore, because he's kind of realizing that Sony's dropped the ball lately. Yeah. Well, they're picking it up again, but with the PS3's launch, they really dropped the ball. $600, and then they lowered it to $500 at the cost of backwards compatibility, which was the only good thing it had I still feel me. that should I would have purchased it anyway, just for a lifetime supply of tacos when Taco Bell was doing it. <laughs> they can't even put real meat in their tacos. You really think that PS3 would have been a real PS3? No, you have to give them a real PS3. Oh, oh yeah, you give you them You donate PS3. it, and then they will... Uh, Give you a lesson. See, I, I thought it was... That person who did it, balling right now. <laughs> I wouldn't want Taco Bell because it's not real meat in their tacos. Because he's going to be like... chemicals. So, uh, 
I'm not hungry, guys. What about you? I guess you gotta go for that snack break now, huh? <laughs> Like, as cool as that sounds, it's like, why Taco Bell? Why couldn't it be like a... Well, now he doesn't have to pay... He doesn't have to, you know, eat ever again. Eat out ever again. That's true. If he feels like eating out, he can just go to Taco Bell for free. But I would get sick of tacos every day, dude. It's like every time you eat out, it's like, I feel like something else. Not free Subway sandwiches or some shit like that for life? I'd be all over it. Yeah, Jared. Thank you for doing your PS3. Here, get my weight loss diet forever. <laughs> Okay, he did something else besides just eat Subway. I've seen plenty of fat people eat Subway. Well, they don't eat it constantly, and they're not also That's working true. out. That's true. Jared did do a lot of good stuff. I mean, like, people are saying, like, all he did was just eat Subway. It's like, no, he probably worked out, too, guys. There's no way you can lose that much weight. A balanced diet and working out Subway. works. Yes, it does work. Hear that, America? Literally, just get off your butts, go outside, run a little bit, or do some push-ups and sit-ups until, like, you're tired. Like, nobody really if knows... If your child says that he will work out so long, like, he will continue to walk and do exercise, if you take him to Disneyland, you better wake him up early the next day, he gets in the car, be like, what are you doing? And you better be like, what are you talking about, Dan? We're going to Disneyland. No. You said that if we, I took you to Disneyland, you would walk for the entire day. Get to walking. <laughs> That's actually a good way to motivate kids to walking all day and keeping their cardio up. Disneyland will wear you out, dude. No, he wants them to walk to Disneyland. No, oh, walk all the way to Disneyland? <laughs> he said he's going to walk all day. Why did you go there? <laughs> I was thinking, like, when you're in the park, because you got to walk to everything. And it's, like, exhausting because you want to, like, if you are if you do what I do and you get there really early in the morning to try and hit, like, all the really popular rides that, like, always have long lines in, like, the early in the morning they never do. So, like, when I took Nina that one time, her and I were, like, literally running from one side of the park to the other. God damn, they just don't fucking die. And you just... Yeah. Okay, that's one way to do it. You just run his ass over. My hand is going numb, alright? Just freaking die. Like, my hand was literally going numb from all the vibration from my controller. Alright, well, he needs to aim at that door, so we gotta go. Right? Because it's not sword lead comes out? Or how do we turn left? It's down here. Sword lead's down here, dude. You gotta go all the way down. You actually see him close the door on you. Right there. Don't let him lock the door. Yeah, that's possible. Damn it! We made it early and everything! It just went less through the door. You can never go through. I tried so many different ways to just skip this whole thing, but then you skip the whole level. Shit. Kill him. All right, we need to get him out of the seat. I will. Hold on. Like get him out and then get in. I'll get into the side seat. Just don't move. Or else he'll die. Can't punch him. You dick. Move I'm forward a little. Yeah. Move forward. Don't nudge me like the slightest nudge will kill me. Alright, now I'm gonna get in the side seat. Get in, dude! Get in! There we go. Alright, let's leave him here. Your job is pretty simple. Don't fuck up. <laughs> yeah, that's all you gotta focus on, soldier. Not fucking it up. I believe in you! My master, the chief, and I punch out. He leads. Wait, hold up. What the freaking A? You can almost taste it. It's just, it's just right there. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, I where'd it go? I punched it and it flew behind me somewhere. Okay. Whatever you 